Hi, my name is Kate and welcome to Digilabs Pro. Today I'm going to be sharing with you how to order with Digilabs. If you haven't had the chance, we suggest you take a look at the DigiTube feed for all of our tutorials at www.digilabspro.com forward slash videos. Digilabs Pro offers free software that allows you to upload web galleries and create, upload, and order customized photo products. You can download this free software at www.digilabspro.com forward slash downloads for free. The cool thing about Digilabs Pro is it's easy and quick, making your life fun. This short tutorial will be covering how to upload and pay for your order with the Digilabs shopping cart. The Digilabs Pro software allows you to design, upload, and pay for multiple orders at one time. This is great for multitaskers because it allows you to efficiently get your work done. Once the software is open, press the product of interest you would like to design on the left. You can then open a new project or open a current project. You can also work on multiple projects at one time in our software. If you'd like to do this, feel free to minimize your project at any time and start a new one. Need to go back? Just click on the Open Projects tab in the bottom right hand corner. Once you're ready to order your Digilabs product, press the Send a Digilabs button in the upper right hand corner. This is how you start your order. Before your file begins uploading to us, the software wants to make sure you're done. The first window that will pop up is called the Preprint Validation Report. The preflight window tells you of any major boo-boos the software recognizes, like blank pages, generic text captions, or low resolution images. The second window that comes up is the proofing window. This is the most important step before uploading because here's where you get to see a preview of what you're ordering. Make sure you look at the design, spelling, cropping, and resolution in this step. If something looks low resolution here, it is. Once you're all set, read over the tiny text and click in the little box and press continue. Once you OK this, your order will begin uploading. A box will then appear telling you your order number and prompting you to close the box to go to the shopping cart. I always suggest jotting this down as a number for reference. And here we are at the shopping cart. The shopping cart should have a job number for your order and any customization features for your order. If you'd like to order more, simply X out of the shopping cart and upload your other orders to continue shopping. Once you've uploaded all your items and are ready to complete your shopping cart, it's time to take a look at what's included. If you see an item there that you don't want, make sure to change the quantity to zero or click the remove from cart button, and this will not be included in your order. To add a promotional discount or account discount coupon, you have to add this on the first page of the shopping cart. Enter promotional coupons in the discount coupon area. Please notice you'll have to enter this promo coupon for every order included in your shopping cart to redeem for all orders included. If you'd like to apply your first time discounts, enter your account ID in the account ID field at the bottom of the page. If you don't have an account, don't worry, you can still place an order. Once ready, press proceed to checkout. The next page of your shopping cart will provide you a summary of what your orders are and ask you to enter some information. Discounts if apply should appear here. You can always go back into your shopping cart by pressing the back button on the bottom. The customer information is where you give your information and shipping information is where you're sending this. All of our products are unbranded so feel free to drop ship to your clients. Once you've completed this, you would press the continue button. The next page allows you to proof your customer and shipping information as well as select a shipping method. Once you're done, press continue. The final step is payment. You can scroll down and fill out the credit card area and press continue to charge. Once you're done, you'll notice a new page comes up with a congratulations. Great job. Now go ahead and print the screen for your records. But what happens if you closed your shopping cart and can't find it? Don't worry. Click on the Home tab and click on My Cart to get to your shopping cart. And that's how you order with Digilabs. Child's play, right? You should receive an email confirming your order and an email once your order ships. Once again, please see our other tutorials at www.digilabspro.com forward slash videos. If you have any other questions, let us know and feel free to contact us directly at 866-344-4522 or email us at support at digilabspro.com. Thanks for listening and look forward to the next one.